We use basketball as kind of a, an avenue to get out to people so they'll watch basketball, but then they'll think about other things that they can do. Welcome to the Saturday edition of the News at 10. A new local wheelchair basketball tournament is using the sport to bring awareness to all the adaptive opportunities throughout Idaho and beyond. This weekend, teams from across the West are playing at the Salvation Army Gym in Boise to showcase their skills. Jude Binkley was at the first ever City of Trees Invitational earlier. Jude, this is pretty unprecedented here in Boise. Absolutely, Morgan. The Gem State Falcons are Idaho's first National Wheelchair Basketball Association team, and their goal is to make people better through basketball and give opportunities through highly competitive sports. Now, the Falcons have played in three regional tournaments so far, but this weekend the Falcons had home court advantage. The biggest thing we try to do with uh, what we're doing is try to get people out and aware of you know, all the adaptive sports that are available. Gem State Falcons co-founder Tom Schroeder says the team is centered around giving athletes a shot at opportunity. Bang! Basically, we use basketball as kind of a, an avenue to get out to people so they'll watch basketball, but then they'll think about other things that they can do. Boise's Division Three NWBA team was founded by Tom Schroeder and his son Tommy to raise awareness for adaptive sports. This weekend is the first City of Trees Invitational, which is bringing in teams from across the West. Uh, we got teams from Arizona, one from Washington, and one from California and ourselves. Wheelchair basketball has a system where players are classified on a point system to give parity to players' accessibility. <laughs> Athletes on the co-ed team range in ability and experience, and while the team is new, not everyone on the roster is a rookie. Tommy Schroeder has been playing basketball for 35 years. He's the team's head coach and point guard. This is the first tournament in Boise. Uh, we played so far in Sacramento. We played in Spokane. And then uh, we played in Phoenix and Tucson. All right, so this is our fourth tournament, first time playing here, a tournament in Boise. The Falcons are partnered with newly formed Idaho Adaptive Sports to get athletes involved in other activities like wheelchair tennis and sled hockey, to continue to grow a community for adaptive sports in the state. I love it. As like I said, I've been playing for 35 years. A lot of guys playing. It's the first uh, they've been playing, but the first year in the National Wheelchair Basketball Association. It's just been a lot of fun because we got a great group, and uh, it's just fun to uh, teach them. And you know, they're they're very hard workers. Great great group to be around. So it makes it a lot of fun. Now tomorrow is the final day of the City of Trees Invitational. The Falcons' first game is at 8 in the morning. Now, Morgan, there are four games tomorrow, so if you'd like to check them out, admission is free. Oh, really nice facility they're playing at, too. Jude, I don't know, did they give you any inkling when their next games would be after this? Do they just do mostly tournaments? Yeah, they, they mostly do tournaments. Okay. Wheelchair basketball, it's huge. There's three divisions. There's a collegiate wow. level, and there's a, a national championship even. So there's, it's a huge sport. Oh, my gosh. Okay. All right, Jude, thank you so much.